Hello everyone, my name is Chronic EXE. I've got this light in my eye, so I'm going to get this done over here quite, quite quickly. Anyway, I've got a new Shield tablet, 32GB uh, LTE. The old one is gone because of, well, I sold it. Um, basically, the battery issue, so this is my replacement, so I'm going to unbox this one. So here's the replacement, hairy hand. I've already undone the stickers at the bottom. There we go, NVIDIA Shield tablet. The ultimate tablet for gamers. And as you would expect, of course, it's in its cellophane, absolutely brand spanking new. Well, it better be bloody brand spanking new rather than a refurb. Let's see if we've got any fingerprints. No, we haven't got any fingerprints. Lovely, jubbly, just my ones. So the back of the shield, of course, has got a nice little actual shield logo. You've got your camera in the corner, you've got a stylus, not much going on. But at the top over here, we've got ourselves a mini HDMI, stereo jack, as well as obviously your USB, your micro USB charger point. Got you know, you've got, you've got little witty bitty speakers here, there, and everywhere. Go to the side of it, you've got your volume rocker, and you've got your turn off and on and off button. Next to that, on the left hand side, just by my thumb, pretty much, you've got yourself an SD card, and then down there, you've got a SIM card. So, this is 4G enabled. Got yourself your little NVIDIA charger, uh, your little documentation booklet, as well as obviously UK versus American, and then of course, you get yourselves. A good old shield tablet charger. Now I swear I got two. I got two cables last time. So that's strange. I know there's nothing underneath it, so there's not much more that I could really do. That's pretty much the unboxing then. So there's the shield. Tegra uh, Tegra K1, I think. Oh, I can't remember what one T1 is a Tegra. But it's got a quad core as well as the actual GPU on top of it. 1920 uh, by 1200 uh, IPS panel, I believe. Uh, emulators and all that kind of lot. And then, of course, if I go over to my PC, wherever my games are, as you can see, I've got a shitload of games all up here. And all of them, of course, I can play on that as well as the video grid service. And at the same time, if you haven't got one of these devices, I suggest you actually get one or wait for the newer variations if they do come out with the Shield Tablet 2. Um, basically, though, you can play emulators. So I've been playing PS1 games, PS2 games, PSP games, Nintendo DS, 3DS, and Game Boy Advance games. I even found an Xbox original emulator. That worked for Halo 2, but no other game for some reason, and I can't find it again. It was on Farfront, and Farfront is now dead, so that's... That, that, that's that's a conundrum. So it's eight inches, of course, from the black bit to the other black bit. That's pretty much all I can say. But otherwise, it's, it looks like it's a bit, either ten-inch tablet or something or other. Relatively thin, just weighs over a hundred grams. Can't wait to get this one booted up again. All right then, I'll see you all soon. Bye.